hello student today we are going to solve a spar gear problem we draw spar gear teeth profile spar gear problem number 1 draw the teeth at least three of a spar gear with the following particulars number of teeth 18 pcd pitch circle diameter 150 mm and pressure angle 20 degree now we solve the problem first we calculate required parameter of spar gear gear calculation here given number of teeth t equal to 18 pitch circle dia pcd capital d equal to 150 mm pressure angle phi equal to 20 degree okay now we know m equal to module module equal to capital d by t pcd by number of teeth equal to pcd equal to 150 by 18 equal to 8.3 mm okay now cp cp equal to circular pitch formula is pi capital d by t equal to pi d equal to 150 by 18 equal to approximately 26 mm now addendum circle diameter that means outer diameter of the spar gear equal to formula t plus 2 into m number of teeth plus 2 into module we put the value t and m then it is approximately 166 mm okay now didendum circle diameter didendum circle diameter formula equal to t minus 2.5 m put the value of t and value of module m equal to approximately 130 mm okay now tooth thickness tooth thickness is the thickness of the teeth along the pitch circle formula equal to cp by 2 circular pitch by 2 circular pitch 26 by 2 equal to 13 mm okay now we know addendum 
equal to addendum a equal to m module equal to 8.3 millimeter okay Dedendum D equal to formula is 1.25 M. M equal to module equal to 10.4 millimeter. Okay. Now tooth depth tooth depth equal to addendum plus dedendum equal to 2.25 m m equal to module putting the value of m m equal to 8.3 equal to 18.7 millimeter approximately now we draw the spar gear teeth profile as per calculated parameters first we draw the x axis this is the x axis and y axis first draw x axis and y axis This is the O intersection point is O. Now, addendum circle diameter by two means addendum circle radius. We take a measurement addendum circle radius with pencil compass. Pencil compass pin is this position. we draw the addendum circle with the addendum circle radius addendum circle diameter by 2 we draw the addendum circle next with pencil compass with radius pitch circle radius pitch circle means pitch circle diameter by 2 pencil compass pin is in this position and pencil is in this position pencil pointer draw the pitch circle draw the pitch circle draw the pitch circle now with radius dedendum circle radius dedendum circle diameter by 2 with pencil compass pin is at position o and pencil pointer is at position this position we draw the dedendum circle we draw the dedendum circle okay now this is the pitch circle and this is the y axis the intersection point of y axis and pitch circle is p now intersection of pitch circle and y axis this point p at this point we draw a tangent we draw a tangent t and t dash now at point p draw a line draw a line at 20 degree equal to pressure angle 
draw a line at P 20 degree this is 20 degree with the tangent T T dash this is 20 degree okay this line is called line of action now at point O we draw a line incline 20 degree equal to pressure angle with the y axis draw a line 20 degree angle with the y axis this is y axis this is the x axis now this point this is the intersection point of line of action and this line this is E point this is E point now we draw a circle with radius O O E we draw a circle with radius O E draw a circle with radius O E this circle is called base circle this circle is called base circle this is the circle now we take a measurement on smaller pencil compass equal to tooth thickness cp by 2 then we cut this this is 0 this is 1 this is cp by 2 tooth thickness with pencil compass with we cut this point this point this point this is number two point this is number three point this is number four point this is number five point okay now we take a measurement on pencil compass radius equal to PCD by 8 we take a measurement on pencil compass radius piece circle diameter by 8 we take this measurement with pencil compass then pencil pointer is at this position 1 and pin pointer we place on base circle in this position now we draw an arc up to the base circle addendum circle to base circle next with radius PCD by 8 pencil pointer is at this position 0 pencil pointer is at this position 0 and pin pointer on base circle pin pointer on base circle pin pointer at base circle we draw an arc addendum circle to base circle by this way we draw this 
arc, addendum circle to base circle, addendum circle to base circle, addendum circle to base circle, addendum circle to base circle. Okay. Now we joined radially. Radially means radius twice. We joined this portion base circle to didendum circle radially. We joined this radially base circle to didendum circle. We joined this base circle to didendum circle. We, we joined this radially. We join this radially base circle to didendum circle. We join this radially. Okay. Now we join this portion with addendum circles. We join this portion with addendum circle radius. We join this portion with addendum circle radius with didendum circle radius we join this portion we join this portion with didendum circle diameter we join this portion with didendum circle radius now we fillet this portion fillet this portion fillet means arc this portion 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 measurement is cp by 8 circular pitch by 8 we draw at least three teeth okay now we only arc this portion only dark this three teeth portion we mark addendum circle we mark pitch circle, we mark base circle, we mark didendum circle. This radius is PCD by 8, tooth thickness, this portion and this portion, this is CP by 2, this is CP by 2 and this arc portion, this arc portion is CP by 8, circular pitch by 8. We mark spar gear and also we write approximate construction. This process is for gear of less than 30 teeth for 30 teeth less than 30 teeth we draw the teeth profile in this process okay this is clear my student thank you